What's up everybody? It's me Tevin the Toy Guy. And this video is not going to be toy related because I'm going to be cooking a pack of these um ramen noodles I got at the ramen ramen noodles I got at the um hometown supermarket. At first I thought it, it this um grocery store also has a Mr. Chen's restaurant in it. At first I thought Mr. Chen owned the grocery store along with it, but the, but Mr. Chen is part of the grocery store. But these are not like the cheap ramen noodle noodles they sell at Walmart. This was fifty cent a pack, even though ramen the regular American ramen might cost that much at other places, but those cost twenty cent at Walmart. These were forty nine cent each, and this was um. One seventy nine for this whole pack, and I had opened them because I'm gonna be cooking one of these. And I actually like how this um, I actually like how this packaging look. This is a product from the Philippines, and this one is from Thailand. But and I got the pan with water in it right here, and I'm gonna turn it on. I'm going to try to open this on camera so I can show y'all what these noodles look like. Because these are going to be my first time trying these. Okay, I see the noodles and I see two more packets inside. And these are Mama brand and this is still beef flavor. So I'm going to take the... um. Hard noodles out and dump them in the water. And I actually like the color too. And I'm gonna pour the rest of the dry noodle crumbs in the um pair with the rest of them. In the meantime, these noodles also came with this um packet. These two packets. This one obviously is the um like the powder the American ramen come with, and I don't know what this is because this is kind of wet, and I can feel how wet it is by touching it. But I will be back, and when I do, I will find figure out how <coughs> I make the um. The ramen flavoring, because this is not like the traditional American ramen we buy out of the grocery store here. But I'll be right back. Okay, I just turned the noodles off and they got really soft, and I'm gonna drain them like that. Mm, they smell really nice. These actually might taste good because they smell pretty nice, even before I put the seasoning on them. And what they did, and I watched a video on how I supposed to put the seasoning on. And the person who showed the video, who uploaded the video, they didn't put the, well, it, wasn't no spe it ain't no special way we got to put the seasoning in. They put it in just like we put the seasoning on regular ramen. And I and I regularly drain my um the other ramen I um eat because that's how I prefer to eat ramen. And sometimes we um leave the water in the noodles when we eat them. Sometimes they lose a lot of flavor. Trying to do this. And I opened this, and whoa, this is not like the um cheap American ramen we got. Because look at these little green, look at the little green things in there. The ones that come with the American ramen ain't normally this thick. I'm trying to stir this on film perfectly. Oh, whoa, this 
This smells pretty nice. I hope I, I stir it enough for me to sample it out and see how I like it because I prefer to do that because I don't want this to be this video to have too many parts I gotta upload afterwards. I decided to try I think I'm gonna eat those first if I like them, then go on to those. Because I actually like my favorite kind of ramen is the beef flavor anyway, but but I'm actually I was actually interested in when I go back I'm gonna have to try the other kind. Cause I can't eat nothing with shrimp and I'm gonna put this um I'm gonna put the liquid mixture in there. I tried to upload me doing a little liquid doing a liquid mixture, but to my surprise is it, it the liquid mixture is pretty thick. I'm actually recording with one hand and stirring in the other. I'm gonna try to buy some more of these um um other ramen noodles from around I mean from the other countries just to try them out. Cause we do have a grocery store that sell all kind of food from all over the world. And and that's why I first smelt the Dorian last week. I, I heard about the Dorian on for many years. People were saying they stink and to be honest they do. And I was not a fan of the uh scent of the Dorian. But anyway, on to me trying these um Thai ramen noodles. Mmm. These taste pretty good, and not only that, they actually feel nice too. These these don't feel like the American ramen I'm used to, but I will be buying these more because I and I actually like the other seasoning these come with. Hmm. Wow, this is amazing. But anyway, this is it for this video. I will, this video will be in two parts because I recorded the part before this one. But I want to let you all know that if you have a grocery store in your area that sells specialty foods from all the other countries, you can find these there because I highly recommend them and they taste pretty good. But that's it for this video.